Okay, we move to the musical scene that has a problem. Hmm, here we go, folks. We have Mr. Frank Kayapa. What nationality yes. is that? Italian. Really? What does it mean in Italian? I don't know. Kayapa. It's actually a town in Salerno. It's at all oh, in Salerno. Oh, okay. And we're on the music scene. And the name of your group is called The Problems. Why yes. is it called The Problems? Uh, couldn't come up with a better name, I guess. Uh, hashed it out for days and no one else had it. All right. Well, covers okay. a lot of ground. It was so, done. So your email then is what? Theproblems.com. Theproblems.com. All right. All right. Okay. Because that sounds more of a psychiatrist's job. <laughs> it should be. <laughs> so now, when did your group start? Uh, about 10 years ago. And what kind of music? It started out different than it is now, but uh, basically it was more hard rocking and basically... Hard rock? No, you know, like no. the hard rock kind of guy. It was more groove oriented, I'd say. Yeah, and how was it today? No, it's more personal. I've shed it. You mellowed down? Uh, I don't know about that. Your hearing went or what? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe. It should have. All right, All right. We, you, we made a clip here. You shot it here? Yes. Okay. Let's take a look at the problems. In our future, the smiling apple pie face for me. In the end, all they really want to do is yours, yeah. The smiling apple pie face for me. You made me wonder what it's like. Kiss your neck and maybe take a bite. Get to know you for your sentimental, your openness, your confidence. No, 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 that won't be so far, far away from me. The body we stand near and near. I feel it when we're close. In my mind, it all could work. If not here, then maybe in San Diego. If you were one such a heartless jerk, you could open up and lay your hate go. Could have written a groundbreaking screenplay. Could have dated Penelope Cruz. Could have stood straight through my posture if I didn't have you. And all your childish behavior. And all the things you say. All the tastes you lick and savor, all the things that make you stay. No, 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 that won't be so far, far away from me. The body we stand near and near. I feel it when we're close. Okay, there it is, the problems. Now, why the orange? Well, that was a watered-down version of the original concept, but... Uh, I thought you had a low budget there. Yeah. But the thing I love about this uh, is the cleverness of uh, how the CD looks. And you get a quick... Uh, put it up. Just put the shot up. There it is. <laughs> all right. Inside the orange. Inside the orange. Now, this CD has all your original tunes on it. This town, what was that about? Uh, this town, uh, New, New York, York City, oh, really? and okay. how hard it is to make it here, I guess. Is it hard to make it here? Huh? No. So if you can make it here, you, you can make, make it, it anywhere. anywhere. Oh, that was okay. in a better song. So, oh, you like that one. All right. It ain't over. Yet. What happened? Lost a girlfriend? Yeah, why not? Okay, still. Still, various scenes, snapshots. Okay. Biggest fan of what? Biggest fan how... You appreciate people for hanging in there. Okay, all right. Two Sides Green. That wasn't my song. It okay. Was a friend of mine. That sounds like a dollar bill to me. Before <laughs> I go. <laughs> uh, when you're leaving, you like to say something. Okay. Break a Hip. That was another one. That's a fun little song. Appreciation okay. again, I guess. Um, I'm waiting for the, the girlfriends day. to show up. 
our college. Well, they're, they're, the, they're at the base of them all. They're at the base of them all. Okay, we'll get to that. Okay, archaeology. What's that was about? Uh, a twist on the uh, digging of and getting uh, down uh, into something. Okay. Gift of Elvis. Uh, Ode to Elvis Presley. I guess. Elvis Presley. Okay. Falling. Falling. That's a girlfriend song, I guess. What happened? Uh, when you meet you someone. fell, she fell, or who we uh, fell out together. Okay, all right. The end of the line. That's a fun another song. Okay, that was, all right. Uh, in for me. Another fun song. That, oh, it's Chuck Berry. Again. Chuck Berry. Okay, birds. Birds um, uh, is a darker one. A darker one. Ooh. You need that too. All right. Uh, Might have gone once. That's lyrical. A lot of lyrics in there. I don't play okay. that one live anymore. Friday. Um, twist on the days of the week. All right. The lottery. Did you win? No, but uh, I'd like to. Okay. Everybody wins. <laughs> and that town. Uh, it's the same song as this town, but acoustic. Okay. Now, what, what's your group into now? What are you up to now? It's uh, more bare bones. Yeah, that's exciting. We what have do you some mean by bare bones? Stripped down, less uh, wall of sound production. Do you play, do you play, what do you play? Clubs? What do you do? Clubs yeah. all around the city. We just played a few shows this past month, and yeah. uh, now we're ready to uh, record our next record. No more records. Next CD. A CD. Yeah. This is happening now. We've got to get the new terms. I know. Yeah. <laughs> That I mean, no, no, because a lot of people, you know, like one person came there one day and they, she they had vinyl? No, she thought that that was still available. The LP was still available on the market. She actually thought that. I said, no, they're gone. <laughs> they're actually coming back. No, they are because they have a special Hats sound. That's bringing them back, back no, single hand. No, because I saw that they have this. The latest bag. Yeah, I know. They have this machine, a laser. You put your LP on the lay on yeah. this disc turntable, and you can transfer it to it the transfer computer. And you pick up all of the deviations off that uh, vinyl without touching the vinyl at all. It's an well, today thing. it's inexpensive enough to just rebuy the CD, right? Yeah, right. But so, but the collectors who own the album, right, would like the this sound thing on of the, the vinyl. It's amazing. Do you have a big collection of music at all? Yes, I do. Unfortunately. Why? Why? Well, I, I like the, to listen. The floor is sagging. Uh, yes, <laughs> definitely, <laughs> definitely. What do you collect mostly? The hard rock everything. Stuff? I like jazz, uh, rock. No hard rock really. Every, everything. You're out of punk. the hard. You're out of the hard rock thing. You like everything. punk? Yeah, sure. What is punk movement? It's a lot of, fast and a lot of racket. Is that like heavy metal or no? No, heavy metal with uh, indie cred. I don't know. Bang bang bang. No, it's good. Oh, it's good okay. to move a little. So you. Guys, now hit clubs playing, shall we say, middle of the road music? Uh, let's say it's roots rock kind of stuff. Yeah. Acoustic. How big is your group? Now? How big is your group? Five. Now? Five. Yeah. Wow. Uh, all a over drummer, the drummer, a multi instrumentalist. So you, you, you go over all over the region. Then? Sure. Okay. And if they want to reach you, it's the problems. Right. Dot com. Dot com. Then you get the record at cdbaby.com. CD baby. De facto is record it, label. Oh, okay. It's is it yours? Is your site or is it is a site that you can? Yeah, it's a like site Amazon? you go. Yeah, you all get right. records. But there. you're doing also tracks for films. How did you get into that? Oh, fortunate. I've been fortunate to have friends who are in the film industry and uh, they like my songs and various people use them. Uh, we were in uh, a film called The Poker Game, predominantly used. Uh, uh, Lonnie hands on. He's a um, so you did all the backup, artist in all Denver. the background sure. music and the whole band. The sure. opening theme and the closing theme. Well, not in that one. Yeah. But uh, Lonnie's film, we were more involved in, and that was very nice because he's a um, what is that? Expert. Multi media Fascinating. artist, yeah. and he does all kinds of things with uh, pastels and glass and everything. Band. And he now when you when they do the tracks for the films, do you go to the sessions where they actually see the film and make no. the music, or you just today you don't the track? have to. Yeah. You, you can, uh, in fact, the next film coming up is uh, The Dying Light, and that'll be out at the end of the summer. And what did you do? And we vocals? wrote the theme song, basically. And vocal? As yes, as well? vocal. Oh, the song was actually based on the story. Line. Because if you really get into that whole scene, it's very, very, very Sure, lovely. it's good to do, very too. It's challenging. You have a story. You have to craft a song around it. But they never give you a scene and say, make the music to it, do they yet? Not yet. That's I would be interested in scoring a, the film. That's, that's a challenge. Something it's to do it's a very, very interesting uh, session if you ever get into that because it's uh, very complex. You think it's easy, it isn't Yeah, I know. Okay, Frank, I thank you. And the group thank is you. called The Problems. The Problems.com. <laughs>
Yeah. All right. Okay. And then, of course, if you want oranges, you got the oranges. That's it. Okay, thank you. Okay, we march on. We'll be right back.